So we have today, uh, we're, we're going to uh, demonstrate uh, testing our um, emergency power system. This is our Silent Central T Series power system. And we're testing these uh, two refrigerators where we have a, an ABS uh, upright glass door, 24 cubic foot refrigerator. We also have a small freezer and both these uh, appliances are plugged into the side of our power system. So right now the power system is plugged into the wall. There's power coming into it and the power is going directly through the system to the refrigerators. Now what's going to happen here is we're going to test this unit and um, what we're going to do is we're going to cut the input power on the system. Now this system is configured with an alarm and this alarm will uh, call out when there's a power loss so you're going to hear this alarm uh, going. But uh, what we're going to do is we're going to disconnect this input power and now it's over to invert mode. So we're basically inverting power now and uh, if you notice the refrigerators, freezers, they're all still on, they're powering them from the battery. And that's a short weekly test, just a matter of unplugging the input power. Now we're going to plug the input power back in, and you're going to notice the panel move from power coming back in. It's going to go to line in, and you should get a green light on the right side. And on the left side, it's going to go from red to yellow to green. Uh, so that's what's going to happen. That's what's happening actually right now. And uh, you're back okay, you can uh, acknowledge your alarm, and uh, that's a simple weekly test. You're gonna to wanna to do that. Make sure you put it on the log sheet, note it down, date and time, and then you're going to wanna to, uh, do a longer test on a monthly basis. We recommend 30% uh, of your runtime that you have. So for example, if this unit is giving off a 12 hour runtime, 25% of that would be a good test. You should run it for maybe three hours. So. Uh, so thanks for watching.